Hello, Hello everyone, Valkyrie. we're playing Valkyrie Drive Hello. Bakuni. Um, it's Valkyrie Drive time. Yes. It's Valkyrie Drive time, <laughs> baby! You must embrace it. Um, there's some plot. There's a lot of plot in this game, yeah, there's, so, there's so people have plot. told me. It's all about the plot. It's uh, 100% um, plot. I don't know much about this game, to be honest. I've, I've written a lot about it, but I don't know that much about it. I haven't played it yet. Hmm. You shall be taught the ways of the Valkyrie Drive. So you... do, you, do you want to read the whole thing, or do you want me to just like tell you what's up? I'm not going to read it out loud, so just tell me. Uh, <laughs> sum summarize it for the viewers at home. Okay, so basically, um, there's a, a virus has broken out called the V virus that's uh, infecting young women in particular. Oh, man. Oh, no. And um, oh, it does one of two things. It turns you into a liberator or an exter. The exters have the ability to turn into a weapon when properly aroused, and the liberators have the ability to arouse. And so, liberators and exters. Exters. Yes. So, I think the real question is which would you be? <laughs> <laughs> well, interestingly, interestingly enough, um, in this game, all the girls can be both. So they can, you can you can swap around. Is that not get you a girl animal? who can do both? Yeah, so so it's like you know, uh, one hand washes the other, I guess. It's, it's, it's a symbiotic relationship, so it's all good. Can take. Yeah. So um. Oh jeez. But yes, so the main characters are uh, Rinka and Ranka, who have uh, both contracted the virus. So they're sent to. How the... do they get this virus? It just happens. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's airborne. Maybe it's in the story. Yeah. <laughs> don't want to spoil it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Actually, you're you're asking the the tough questions. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I've not actually seen the anime. Um, but yeah, so they're sent to the island of Bikuni, which is um, the only island that had any success in actually curing people from the virus. And uh, upon arriving, they they found some. Surprises as to like how they can. So why themselves. don't they want to be liberators and exes? What's so bad about the virus? Will it eventually kill them? Uh, yes. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a slight problem. It, it does. Fair it enough. Does, it does give you like like superhuman powers, but it also can kill you. So. <laughs> <laughs> I just had some grunting from it's the other. Strange end. Uh, It's worth uh, mentioning that we're playing on PS TV. If you didn't realize, this game is PS TV compatible. That's kind of cool. That is amazing to see Valkyrie Drive in like big O vision. Yeah, because it is a Vita exclusive. You wouldn't usually be able to play this on a big screen. But, it's pretty uh... cool. So the story plays out like visual novel style, I guess. Yes. Kind of like the Senra Kagura games, I suppose. It is very similar. Uh, I'm just gonna speed read it because I'm better than everyone else at reading. I think she forgot to button her her shirt properly. No, oh, disgrace. No, oh, I hate when that happens. And <laughs> you know, you go to like an important job interview. Oh, excuse you just, like, me. You walk out and you're like, damn. <laughs> I was like this the entire time. <sighs> <laughs> so does everyone live on big like islands? Uh, no, there's there's five islands that have been established as like uh, quarantine sectors for people who have contracted the virus, um, and it's like some sort of international coalition that uh, established all these islands. So it's, it's fine for them to live. So they, they, everyone on this island is a liberator or an exter, basically. Uh, yes, or, 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 working or working to cure them. What year is this set? Is this like in the future? I I have no idea. The far flung f future of 20XX. <laughs> it does appear that uh, they they got to the island without ever like doing any paperwork <laughs> or figuring out what they were supposed to be doing. There. Show up. Oh, how did I get here? <laughs> So I guess they use robots because they don't want to be infected. Are these like quarantine robots or is this just the standard in this feature? Uh, I have no idea. Sorry, I'm asking so many difficult does. questions. <laughs> I have a lot of questions. The robot did ask for their entry pass. 
Oh, this is like that one time we were on the tube of Bryce and he couldn't find his uh, train ticket. Oh, Remember no, that? Really? That was the worst day of my life. <laughs> the worst day of Trey your life? Trey just has to buy a new one. So what do you do? He found it. <laughs> Great story. I hate that kind of thing. Man, I would be so bad in this situation. I would just get totally destroyed by robots. <laughs> it's a bit harsh that these robots are just programmed to just exterminate anyone without a pass. Yeah, that's, that's quite a, I quite bet a people, harsh punishment for not having your ticket. People just like lose their stuff sometimes. Could you just buy a ticket? Like if you didn't have one and he's like exterminate and you're like... Oh, yeah, no, no, uh, yeah, yeah, well, they yeah. said a, their parents had to pull a lot of strings to get them on there. So I guess it's, it's not like it's not like you get a train ticket to London. <laughs> And I love how the robots want to get them, and they're just like, well, game on, I guess I got my sword out then. <laughs> oh, I just happened to have this as well. Yeah, just like, just two ordinary school girls. Um, With a sword. But then we also carry katanas around. Hmm. Tutorial time. You gotta look at things. You're looking at the wrong thing. <laughs> look at the right thing, that. Oscar. Okay, I'm good at this game. <laughs> I'm very good at this game. I'm glad that the robots are just waiting for me to do this. <laughs> it's like, oh, well, just give me five minutes to get used to it. Just got, got, got to warm oh, up gee, first. I guess if you don't know how to double jump, it wouldn't really be fair. <laughs> i got to get over these boxes. Oh. <laughs> oh I Great saw. job. <laughs> Harder than it may seem. I've not done this before, so <laughs> I've never played a 3D action game before, so I have no idea. Um... Combos. Now he's talking my language. Excellent. Special moves, huh? Oh, she's got like a samurai quick draw type thing. Oh, now he's got a friend. Oh, it reminds me of uh, Nero. <laughs> No, no, that's not, that's not it. That's Virgil. Virgil from Devil May Cry. Yes. Yeah. I was gonna say he that does that. Really makes sense. He does that. Ah, okay. It's nice to pull the camera out a little bit. I was, I was thinking it's a bit tight, maybe. It's a problem. I am liking this on the PS TV though. I feel like probably I should invest in some PS TV action. <laughs> oh yeah, they're really cheap. I feel like everyone is just going to have one at some point. Yeah. So just all ship games out compatible with the PS TV? Not all games. Oh. Um, hashtag it... not all games. But, uh... <laughs> is it games that uh, use the touchpad functionality a lot and stuff that don't work? Yeah, though you can do touchscreen stuff mm. on the touchpad. Mm. Or on the PS3 version as well. There's DualShock 3. You can just use sticks a lot of the time. More games than you think. <laughs> Don't want to brag, but I did get a double S on Battlefield Drive. <laughs> double S. You're so S rank. What's this? Oh yeah, you can Ooh. you can level up uh, your characters. Uh -oh. So nice. now you just leveled up your your liberator. You didn't level up your extra much. Get far. Oh dear. Uh, it's because I press X, which allocates all. Oh. So I didn't I didn't realize. Gotta be OP. <laughs> Unlocking some stuff. stuff. That was a lot of stuff because I got double S probably, so they nice. wanted to yeah. give me everything. And Giving a trophy. You all the cool stuff. So Bakuni is the name of the island. Yes. Huh. They just like showed up and smashed some things. <laughs> I gotta take this island down. Proceed to the next part. So, um, basically, whenever you play a story mission. Or you finish a story mission, you're able to go back and play the story mission again with uh, different characters. So it's similar to Sanon Kagura in that way. And that you will you will be assigned certain characters for that mission. Ah, okay. And then uh, you can play with other characters later on if you want to. Does that mean you can unlock certain other things with other characters? Or, or is it just purely for gameplay? Purely for gameplay, I think. Uh, and to level up all your characters. Ah, yes. If you want to get 100%, you got to be every level, every character. Yeah, pretty much. Them's the breaks. 
You would have thought someone would like meet them right at the. You think someone would be selling some buns or something? <laughs> They all react in perfect <laughs> synchronization. Maybe that's the virus. <laughs> so you mainly fight robots? Um, no, you fight. Uh, well, there there are a lot of robots there <laughs> on there the are island a lot of to uh, test the girls, but then the girls fight each other as well. Hey, who was groping her breath? Okay. There she is. Ninja girl. <laughs> Didn't even see her coming. I think she's probably my favorite character, Ninja Girl. Really? She's Why? got roller skates. Does she? It's so nice just to skate around on That her. doesn't seem very subtle though. Like they would hear you coming if you're, <laughs> you're like not if they're well lubricated. <laughs> well lubricated roller skates. Uh, okay. like showing up on some sick roller blades. <laughs> Are these all four playable characters? Uh, yes. Certainly a lot of story now. Mm. No, we're, we're only getting started. The V-Virus, okay. <laughs> I need to take notes, I think. At least the island looks kind of cool. Is that I, an island? Yeah, that's Isn't an interestingly shape? shaped island. It looks almost like a ship. Yeah, it's not a ship though. You sure? I'm pretty sure. Oh, it does look like it kind of... No, no, that's, so that's smoke carrot. from a chimney on the back there. It's not actually moving forward. Ah. So it'd be pretty sick if it was a ship. Funny <laughs> I think we can all agree. I think my dream is to have an island ship. To establish my own nation. So uh, please like and subscribe. And eventually we can make that dream a reality. Of the rice digital <laughs> island? Uh, yeah. Or is it the Oscar Island? Oscar Topia? Depends. Depends how how various things shake out. I wouldn't want to. Don't want to <laughs> make any announcements. Still hush hush. Tonight. You see, if I rolled up to a hospital and they just told me that I had to fight, I would probably be a bit pissed off. Oh, you have to become <laughs> stronger in order to control your virus. <laughs> So Would, wouldn't that be like an interesting robots challenge? in the hospital? It'd be like, more interesting than just lying. In deal bed. with it. <laughs> you have to, you have to level up and become the best in order to save yourself oh, from sickness. I guess I'm, I guess I have to be up for the challenge. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I don't have much of a choice. <laughs> you show up in a hospital like, oh, I'm dying. I feel really <laughs> shit. Yeah. Here, have a sword. Just like, here's a weapon, yeah. and there's some robots out in the hallway. This is the only way. You'll work better. through it. Hmm. You got, it's got to get worse before it gets better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a school. Don't worry about it. There's a lot of law to take in. <laughs> well, you got it. You got established this early on. Good old exposition dump. <laughs> you can always come back and replay it if you forget. <laughs> exactly. So is this the core team? Uh, there's gonna be more. Okay. I think there's uh seven characters in all. Not counting various mysterious DLC characters no. that we've not uh, spoken about before. <laughs> Probably Quickly sip say the tea. Because <laughs> the Senra Kagura is like a it's like a core team of four, mm. and that's also in a school situation. Hmm. Well, there's there's two teams though. There's several teams in, in, mm, in Senra yeah. Kagura. So the robots are for training purposes. Well, they can't just beat up random civilians. Are you just on the beach? Why not? Chilling out <laughs> underneath your your umbrella. I've seen some shit. robot comes and punches you in the face. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I never go on holiday out of the country anymore. Wait, which one am I? Am I Rinko or Ranko? You're Rinko. Okay, just trying to get a good look at her so I remember where she is. Rinko. Yeah, you got Rinko and Ranko, and then we just met Momo and Mana. Yeah. God, you know that way too correct. much about this. Get! Armed girl. So are these robots as well, or are they just. Who are this? Oh, this, I, this is people. probably just like another girl from your school, I guess. I see. And she's she's been up to no good because been... she has she has an arm. Mm. Since that you know she's been uh, 
diddling one of our schoolmates. Oh dear. Okay. Although apparently the schoolmate only turned into like a tiny little knife. <laughs> so. That must be so disappointing if you come yeah. to school you're like, oh yeah, I'm become a giant sword or something. Oh no, you're so. Well, you gotta practice. A little tiny thing. Uh. Just like. Like you, you're really excited because you might. Like, so do I, I not become, have a weapon? Like, a battle axe or something. Yeah, or a bazooka. <laughs> and then you turn out to like be a spoon. You gotta practice. A spoon. <laughs> So apparently the combat in this one's all about the airplay. Apparently that's the big thing. Uh, yes. Um, you can press uh, circle to launch and then circle again to follow them into the air. I did it, I did it wrong. And then do more, do more stuff. Um, that's how you get the big combos in this game. And then I think yeah, after the knockback attack you can follow up again. So it's kind of similar to, um... Oh, that fighting game. What's that fighting game, Oscar? Which one? Arcana Heart. This is what I was uh, looking for. Where you have, like, no model, a, then. a homing attack, almost. Where, um, you launch someone into the air and then you kind of, like, home into them with a the, with the touch of a button. To follow up for more combos. Is that Nitro Plus? Um... No, there isn't an Arcana Heart character in Nitro Plus that can do it. Okay. <laughs> Pursuit and Spike. Nice. So what, so what else can I do in here? I don't know, punch people. Knock them up. And then follow them again. Spike them down, follow them down. Okay, it's gonna take me a little bit <laughs> um, Your abilities will change once you kind of um, unlock your super weapon. Oh. She died already. <laughs> I killed a lot of people at this school so far. I'm not sure they're gonna keep me on. Approach the chest guard and let it grope you with circle. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah. The, the the chest guard will test your boob rank. I'm sexy and I know it. So if you've taken your girl into the dressing room and touched her enough and leveled up her boob rank, uh, you will be accepted to into the like this uh, special part of the level, where you can get uh, the chest guard's inspection. Yes. <laughs> then you can get cool rewards. What so the fuck? <laughs> you can get cool. You can get new items. You can get experience. You can get new clothing items. Uh, so it's like bonus stuff. rewards. Yes, yeah. but only if your boob rank is high enough. Is this the main reward here? Yes. What's this? Oh no, not the flying ones. Shooter girl. She's tiny. Okay, so the dash doesn't just go horizontally. You can also. Yeah, the dash will go to like um, whoever you have targeted. No matter where they are. Nice. Alright. All right. Developing them skills though. These are the skills of a hardened Devil May Cry player. <laughs> I put hours into Devil May Cry 4 training for this. My pre Valkyrie drive training. Just to get S ranks on all of the Devil May Cry series. <laughs> only then will I be good enough. Ah, oh, only single S. Gone down. Single S, oh no. It's because I spent all that time looking at her at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> My time wasn't good enough. Should probably level up her, right? Probably. D rank. Oh. So you need to level up the X star to be able to do multiple drives. Yes. Okay. Uh, so when you do uh, the drive, like depending on what level of drive you go into, um, it'll determine the girls' interactions as they as they go into drive mode. Adds up. Makes sense. So it is there. There is like. 
some meter management going on in the game in that um, in your base form you're not really that powerful and then you have to decide whether you wanna I know that build up your, your meter and go into drive mode immediately or do you wanna stay in your base mode and then build up the drive mode to like level 2 or level 3 and in order to, to become more powerful but then in some levels you kind of want to go into drive mode immediately because you you might get killed <laughs> if 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 you don't power up. So um, got to like think about how you want to spend your meter. Yeah, there's an element of that in Senra Kigura as well, isn't there? Like with the when you initially transform into the ninja. Yeah. You can kind of hold that off a bit for maximum. Yeah. Damage. <laughs> yeah, because you do get your life back and stuff when you do that. You think you would pass the exam? I'm pretty confident. I go to the beach. That's where the exam is. You show up. This is a girl with a knife. <laughs> <laughs> She's out for blood. <laughs> I think I would probably be dead. <laughs> I would have just got shanked to let us die on that beach. <laughs> just bleeding out into oh, the dear. sea. Staining the sand red. <laughs> I don't think that's Ofsted approved. <laughs> <laughs> so these education cutbacks. Well, if you're gonna get shanked, the beach is a nice place to, to have it happen though. Nice scenery. Yeah. Last final view. Of it's gonna determine whether or not you get to get into a grammar school. <laughs> <laughs> like better on the beach than like in some sort of dirty alley. The beach, nature's dumping ground. <laughs> Eventually, he'll wash out to sea, just leave him. Don't worry about cleaning it up. The waves will Feed take the him. The waves will take him eventually. <laughs> just wait for high tide. <laughs> the problem is solved. As my bloated corpse is washed out to sea. 